Good morning, dogs. Happy Friday. Ah. Racing Festival and more after the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you guys still haven't heard, the Rice's Festival will be having their 2024 essay contest that is for Clinton County residents in grades 9 through 12. There will be a cash prize with first place being $200, second place being $100, and third place being $50. There will be more information on this in the hot dog chatter. We're in the month of May, so make sure you keep turning in your assignments, especially seniors. We have 22 more days until graduation, so keep working hard, hot dogs. That'll be all for me. Now to Brian with sports. Good morning, everyone. I don't really have much to say for today, so it's going to be a bit short. Now, we have the baseball boys going to travel to Peru to do a round robin, and we'll be starting at 10 in the morning. But they'll also be playing at Delphi starting at 12 p.m. to do another game of round robin. And there's the girls softball team going to do a tournament tonight. And also, dogs, listen up, because on Monday the 6th, there will be an open gym for basketball. And on Wednesday the 8th, there will be a call out for anyone who is interested in playing basketball for next year. And there will also be an open gym as well. But like I said before, today's sports section is a bit short. But now, I'm going to send it to Burge with weather. Thank you, Brian, for that wonderful sports report. Kicking things off for today's weather forecast, I do hate to say it that we did see some light drizzles overnight and early morning soaking everything. I do hope you all got outside yesterday, though, as it was the highest and warmest day of the year. Unlike today, the high will only manage to climb to a tolerable 73 degrees with some light showers thrown in the mix. And with those light showers, there is also a 40% chance of moderate rain for the most of the day. And don't get too upset because tomorrow is supposed to jump back up to a nice 80 degrees and mostly sunny for that. After all, it is Indiana though, so just so you never know. That's going to conclude today's weather segment, and I'll send it back over to your hosts. For lunch today in lines one and two, cheese quesadilla, and lines three and four is baked potato. A special happy birthday goes out to Cruz Alanis Mejia, Jose Roman Campos. Happy birthday, dogs. That's all for the morning announcements. Have a great weekend, hot dogs.